Hi, my name is Danielle Carney, and I'll be talking to you about the True 3D Laser Plasma Display. The True 3D Laser Plasma Display is different than the 3D displays we use today. Many previous displays in 3D have been virtual images on 2D planes which due to human binocular disparity appear as 3D. However, the limitation of our visual field and the physical discomfort caused by the wrongly identifying virtual images make these displays less than perfect. While most 3D displays available today involve a form of optical illusion that depends on the parallax or disparity inherent in human binocular vision, this new system which can function in air or underwater, needs no screen of any sort, and the effect is quite impressive. It may be a while before this technology becomes good enough to replace our 2D display TVs, but there are high hopes to get it used as a form of digital signage soon. That's sure to catch your eye more than a poster or video advertisement does, at least until it becomes so commonplace no one notices it anymore. The display could also be used to analyze 3D objects, and with some improvements could be used in the healthcare field. To create the effect, focused laser light excites the naturally occurring oxygen and nitrogen atoms in the air, otherwise known as plasma excitation. The new device uses the plasma emission phenomena near the focal point of focused laser light. By controlling the position of the focal point in the direction of the x, y, and z axes, real 3D images in air can be displayed. The images are constructed from dot arrays produced by a technique combining a laser light source and galvanometric mirrors. It works by focusing laser light to produce plasma excitation from the oxygen and nitrogen in the air. The researchers state that this is the world's first technology to show images without the constraint of a screen. え、2次元の映像をあの、スクリーン上に投影して、で、疑似的にあの、目の錯覚によって 3D the engineers at Burton Incorporated worked in collaboration with the original developers of the technology. The National Institute of Advanced Industrial Science and Technology, also known as AIST, and Kyo University. All three are located in Japan. AIST is one of the largest public research institutes in Japan, which supports Japan industry. It also functions as an open hub of open innovation among industry, academia, and government. Kyo University was Japan's very first private institution of higher learning. In the future, Britain plans on making the product smaller and also increasing its power to make larger sized images. If this technology continues to advance, we could one day have 3D experiences without the need for glasses or even a screen. This new technology could be used in movie theaters or even in our own homes. Buy it, use it, break it, fix it, trash it, change it, melt, upgrade it, charge it, point it, zoom it, press it, snap it, work it, Thanks for watching! Use it, write it, cut it, paste it, save it, love it.